Bless it, bless it, bless it, bless it be the name. Bless it be the name of my God. I love him, I love him. I love him, I love him, I love him, I love him. I love him, I love him. I want you to know that in the name of God. Hey, lift him up. Bless it, bless it, bless it, bless it be the name. Bless it, bless it, bless it, bless it be the name. Bless it, bless it, bless it, bless it be the name. Bless it be the name of my God. I love him, I love him. I love him, I love him, I love him, I love him. I love him, I love him. I want you to know that in your name above him. I love him, I love him. I love him, I love him, I love him, I love him. Bless it, I love him, I love him. The topic today is using your master key. As an adult man, I stand before you as a demonstration. In my life, I don't have many keys. You know, I don't have keys to Section A homes, keys to commercial buildings, keys to rental properties, uh, keys to commercial buildings again, keys to my own very home, keys to cars, keys to my own heart. These keys have opened many doors, many doors in my life experience. Lessons, joys, disappointments. I stand before you and ask to yourself, what keys of the kingdom are you using? The book of Matthews says, I will give you the keys of the kingdom of heaven. Whatever you bind on earth will be bound in heaven. Whatever you loose in, on earth will be loose in heaven. The Webster Dictionary gives the definition of a master key, a key that opens several locks, each of which also has his own key. The custodian has the master key to all the classrooms. God is the maker of keys. God is the author and the finisher of our lives. See, he controls all our keys. He gives us the key to everything. God is the custodian of all our classrooms. The blood of Jesus paid our entry. God wants to give you the master key. When Jesus came and asked disciples, who do people think, who do people say the son of man is? They replied, some say to John the Baptist, others say Elijah, and still others, Jeremiah or one of the prophets. You are the Messiah the son of the living God. Amen. Jesus replied, blessed are you, Simon, son of Genoa, for I was not revealed to you, that was not revealed to you by the flesh uh -huh. and blood. Right. Excuse me. <laughs> but by my father in the gates, of, but by my father in heaven. Yeah. And I tell you, that you are, Peter, and I will rock, and I will build my church, and the gates of the Hades will not overcome it. I will give you keys to the kingdom of heaven. Well, whatever you bind on earth will be bound in heaven, and whatever you loose on earth will be loose in heaven. Then he ordered the disciples to tell anyone not to tell anyone that he was the Messiah. Yes, sir. Through Peter's faithfulness, pro, pro, proclamation of the gospel, Peter will open the doors to the kingdom to those who respond in his faith. Yes. So we got to have faith because if not, 
he's not going to open them doors. You know? While at the same time, keeping it shut to those who do not. Because of the gospel determines what is bond and what is loosed, there are kingdom keys for each of us. Turn to your neighbor and ask them, are you ready to open some doors? Turn to your other neighbor and ask them, are you ready to shut some doors? Are you ready to shut some doors? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Because, see, God, he, he's such of an awesome God that he ain't just going to give us the keys to open the doors because, you know, every time something good, Satan right there, too, coming at us. You know, he coming at us saying, hey, let me disturb this. But he give us the ability to shut him out. It's up to us to shut him out, you know, because with that master key comes power and authority. So, saints, we got the power and the authority to open the doors and shut doors that we don't want around us. What are we binding in Lucy? Have you decided to act on the authority and power God has given you by being your own master key? This afternoon, we're going to lose some things. You know, we're going to lose restoration. We're going to lose faith. We're going to lose debt free. We're going to lose happiness. We're going to lose joy. We're going to lose wealth. And we're also going to buy some things too. We're going to bind defeat. We're going to bind diabetes. We're going to bind cancer. We're going to bind heart problems. We're going to bind discouragement, anxiety, fear. And depression. So you I just want to thank you, Jesus. I want to thank you. I'm thanking him for all the things he's loosening and all the things he's binding. In Jesus' mighty name, we're going to confess that we got our master keys. Amen. Blessed, blessed, blessed be the name. Blessed be the name of my God. I love him, I love him. 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 I want you to know that they know him above. Hey, lift him up. Blessed, 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 blessed be the name. Blessed, 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 blessed be the name. Bless it, bless it, bless it, bless it be the name. Bless it be the name of my God. I love him, I love him. 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 I want you to know that ain't no name above him. I love him, I love him. I love him, I love him. I love him, I love him. Bless it be the name of God.